What's up guys? Doing a home workout since the gyms are closed. Gonna go through a little uh, push day. Hit the chest, shoulders, triceps, all that. So let's get into it. Our first exercise is gonna be dumbbell bench. We're gonna do four sets of 15. Alright, just finished chest press, now we're going into lateral raises. Doing four sets by 15, probably gonna use 15 to 20 pounds. So let's get into that. I'm bringing heat, you'll be a fan when I start rapping way. I'll have your fucking head spinning. I'm known as spit vicious. Release bombs and go tick tick. Boom, you blow me that head missing. I'm a phenomenon. Stacking cheese like it's Parmesan. Eight different flows call me Octomom. I'm moving fast like the Autobahn. And I'm independent, so I'm not your fucking starving like it's Ramadan. Sick, twisted, gifted, can't copy, printed, can't hold me down. I shape shift, I'm liquid. I kill this beat. Getting 20 on that, so we'll go up to 20s on the next set. Do about a minute and a half of rest here. So we'll get that going, a minute and a half of rest. And then we'll go right back into it. All right, for this set, we're gonna do as many as I can with 20, do a drop set, go down to probably 12 and a half, do as many as I can, and then probably 10, as many as I can. Really get those uh, side delts pumped up. Let's go. Feel the burn, jeez. That's good, drop sets are a great way to add intensity to your workouts without having to add weight. And it helps you just go past failure when you're doing extra reps like that. It's a great tool to use in your training, try it out. Only got eight that time. This bench doesn't let me uh, go in between here. It's this or flat. If I could, I'd like to be a little bit less at an incline and more chest and less shoulders, but we're working with what we got. Uh, it's gonna work your shoulders a little bit more because of your being upright here. So shoulders are coming into play. Probably front delts, so just something to keep in mind. If you do have a bench that you can incline, in between this and flat. Now, if you're trying to work your chest more, you don't want a really steep angle. 
You'd want less angle than I have right now. You gotta eat less than I'm less than you eat here. Next thing we're getting into now is going to be tricep extensions on the flat bench. So that's the next one we're doing. Let's get into it. When you're doing those, you're gonna wanna make sure you feel it in your tricep. Kind of keep that contraction slow and keep your elbows in place. Don't let them roll forward and out. Try to keep your elbows as stationary as possible to really feel in your tricep. find a great way to go past failure on those is tricep negatives which you just saw me do slow um, eccentric phase like count to three or four on the way down and you shift up and chest press it up do it again slow eccentric phase it really pushes your triceps past failure and it's a great tool to use so try the tricep negatives next time all right last set of rear delts and the tricep kickbacks. Let's go. Set to 12. And that's that boys oh man we got her done first lift back since Thanksgiving I didn't work out for like four days haven't really been eating healthier at all on my diet been eating a bunch of crap so it's time to get back into it a little bit and if you're struggling after Thanksgiving binge eating stuff like that just know you're not alone. Get back in there, start grinding. Four days a week, it's okay. You didn't ruin your physique. You'll get it back. Just get back on track and you're good to go. So I hope you guys like this workout. Hit the like button, subscribe if you want to. See more home workouts since my gyms have closed. I'll show you some great ways to get a good pump, get a good lift in at home with dumbbells only. So if you want to see that, subscribe. Peace, guys.